criticism to not not run again. So what, what led up to that? Well, you know, if this was a four-year decision or a six-year decision, might have been a bigger decision, but it's an eight-year decision, and. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm grateful for the time I've had to serve. I think this is going to be a particularly good election year, frankly, for Republicans. I think 2022 will be a great year for someone new to take this Senate seat, just like 2010 was. In fact, I think our friends on the other side are almost replicating, and maybe at warp speed, uh, not to overuse a term that we've used with my involvement well, with vaccines, but at a very quick rate, I think they're heading in a direction that will make 22 a great year for Republicans. I think it would have been a great year for me. Uh, you know, lack of confidence has never been my problem particularly, but I felt good about getting elected. What I felt less good about was whether I wanted to go from 26 years in the Congress um, to 32 years in the Congress and uh, maybe eliminate the other things I might get a chance to do um, when, I, when I leave the Congress. So I'm... Uh, so I think it's a good decision for the Congress. I think it's a good decision for me. I think it's a good decision for what happens uh, for future uh, representation for our state in the Senate and look forward to 22 being a great election year. The biggest stories, the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.